just going to ask you about James. I mean, he made a couple of forces, but he made no mistake at all, so it's been great to see him. Absolutely outstanding performance. Um, we've certainly spoken about guys going on throughout this series, and today it was a crucial innings. Um, I think the wicket became more difficult to play on as the innings progressed, and James adapted beautifully. And you've battled with him in all three of these matches. Is he particularly good to bat with because he sort of moves it around, is not he? Yeah, he is, yeah, and he's, he's rapid between the wickets. He sort of laps me, which is quite <laughs> enjoyable. But so he, he's very unique the way he plays. And he can, having played against him quite a lot in county cricket, he can be annoying to captain against, um, which is always a good sign if he gets runs for us. Yeah. Uh, I guess Trevor the other day mentioned there was a lot of possibility about maybe using Moe in sort of number three. Does that mean that, uh, I guess, sort of by saying that, that James was up against it and I mean, it has, in spite of that, it's kind of increased your really performance? I think on the back of that, he, he, he probably meant that Moen's a very versatile cricketer. Um, I don't think anybody was up against it. Um, I think this is the balance of the side we're going with at the moment. I think Moen's very flexible with where he can bat, given the positions he has batted in in the past. So I think, for the moment, I think it can it won't change. Ali, oh, just, uh, just a word on your two spinners. Probably. Yeah, they were exceptional. Um, I think um, five for seventy in twenty years, something around there, um, was outstanding. Um, considering in the last couple of games we've struggled to take wickets in the middle period. Um, they took advantage of conditions, they never let up. They probably bowled one or two bad balls in those 20 overs. Um, and more importantly, they continued to put Australian batsmen under pressure. And it must be quite encouraging with the game back here on Sunday, if you can get a winner heading in the series side up. It is, absolutely. And again, I suppose as a side, we were up against it a little bit. and to come out today and produce such a strong performance all round, I think, was was brilliant. Yeah. Uh, it was a great picture of uh, you and Ben Stokes and your reaction to Steve Finn's catch, and neither of you looked like you could quite believe it. <laughs> no, I, can't, I still can't believe it. Um, no, it was an exceptional catch. I've never seen Finney take catch like that, so I was very surprised, um, but delighted at the same time. It was an absolutely unbelievable catch. I'm uh, just going back to the spinners. I mean, with the tour of the UAE coming up, how promising was, was was it to see them bowl so well in tandem? Yeah, very promising. Um, and I think having options of of obviously turning it either way is is crucial. Um, Adil, as I've said before, is vital to a side when he bowls well because he he can beat the bat on both sides. Um, Mullen gives it a, a real good rip and and doesn't bowl many bad balls um, and I think today he was exceptional, uh, similar to Lord's. <coughs> and just a bit on Adil and also on Jason, who uh, played a, a top innings at the start, are you beginning to see the more the players play and view them with more confidence that the more you're, you're getting out of them? Yeah, absolutely. Um, I've said in the, in the, I suppose after the previous two games that I suppose if we save 25 with the ball and we're chasing 25 less, less, less with the bat, it's a completely different game. And I've seen a lot of progression in the last three games. Um, and you can, you can always make progression even if you win or lose. And I think we have done that. And it'll be a continued test against Australia throughout the rest of the series. Um, I think you're right. We have seen a lot of players grow. And that's crucial because when you come up against a side like Australia, if you're not learning, they can hurt you. Um, but I think we are a learning side. Particularly with Jason, I mean, he was going at you know, quite a decent strike rate, but didn't really appear to even be in his top gear. He seemed to play yeah, he appeared to be. It appeared to make it look easy, um, and I suppose that's a credit to the work he's put in probably before the series. And again, it 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 did. It looked effortless. It was it was great to watch.